Just relax. Just relax. You, you keep Just moving relax. around. This is new video tonight showing the arrest made during a Groveport Madison versus Canal Winchester football game. This is the second year in a row for this kind of arrest. This year, no one was injured. Thanks for joining us at five. I'm Andrew Kinsey. Yolanda is off. Tin TV's Lacey Crisp spoke with police and has that body worn camera video tonight showing the minute officers found the gun. She's live tonight from Madison Township with the details. Yeah, not one, not two, but three guns were recovered. All had Glock switches, which make those guns automatic. All of those guns were taken from the teens. We've been told more than once that you have a potential gun on you. Step back. It was during the third quarter on Friday night's game when Madison Township police and school administrators questioned a teen after a fight broke out. Body camera video shows the officer quickly found a gun on the teen's leg. The video shows the officer coming in contact with a second teen. Here, I'm going to pat you down real okay, fast. Come around. A school resource officer quickly finds yet another Glock in the backpack. The game continues even after officers chase after the second teen. A third teen is then brought from the stands. You're at a school function. The, the staff has asked us to search you. Do you have any weapons on you? No, I didn't find nobody. So okay. To me. Turn around. Yes, we can. You'll be all right. If you don't have anything. I'm, I'm not going to move. I'm not going to move. God bless. 449. Third firearm recovered. Madison Township police say the teens, an 18-year-old, two 17-year-olds, and a 16-year-old were taken into custody. You know, again, you got three uh, loaded Glock 9 millimeters. Um, why bring those to a football stadium? Police Chief Gary York says two of the four have been arrested in Franklin County in the past. He also says this 16-year-old was arrested January 26th of this year for carrying a concealed weapon and improper handling of a firearm in a motor vehicle. These kids, and that's what I'll call them, were laughing when they were in the backseat of our cruisers. They are not taking it serious. They think this is a joke. They know the system. They know there's no consequences. Yeah, so right now they don't have metal detectors at Canal Winchester Games. School officials there would not go on camera with me today, but tell me they are working on updating safety protocol before next Friday's game. Reporting live, Lacey Crisp, 10 TV News. Lacey, thanks so much. Last year during that same matchup, there was another incident involving a gun. There was a shooting last year at that game. No one injured. 18-year-old James Keyes was arrested and charged in federal court. That game was held in Groveport, Madison. After that incident, there were some changes made. The district installed a new metal detector system and banned book bags from those games.